Lee's Italian Kitchen. Today we're making chicken soup. I'm frying some chicken pieces, chicken breast, and about a tablespoon of olive oil. We're going to season it with some seasoned salt. A little bit of pepper. I know this is chicken soup, but we're frying the chicken first. Now I'm going to add the uh, celery, onions, and carrots. I've already diced those up. And we're going to let this brown. This is going to be very flavorful soup. You can see how it's cooking really nice and brown and... Uh, I put the uh, your stove on pretty much on high, and this will give the chicken a really nice uh, few minutes here to get nice and well seasoned. That sure is making a lot of noise. Oh, drop something there. Okay, so here we go. Keep cooking this. It's important that uh, you let the chicken brown because that's what gives the soup the flavor. You can see how the chicken is starting to brown. All the flavors are getting mixed together. I'm going to flip those around a little bit more. Yeah, doesn't that look good? Okay, so we have our celery, onions, and carrots. I like to leave my carrots kind of big. They look nice when you're serving the soup. I also uh, um, cut my onions a little large, too. Okay, now we're going to add our chicken broth. I have two cans, two 14-ounce cans of chicken broth with salt. Okay, we're going to put that in there like that. Stir it around. Get all the flavors together. And now I'm going to add some water. Oh, about, uh, I'd say about two cups more of water. It looks like about three cups. <laughs> We're going to put in a bay leaf. And now I'm going to add a little bit of saffron. Now this is a very expensive spice. So if you, you know, don't want to use it, it's okay. It just makes the soup really nice and yellow looking. Really nice. Now I'm adding a, I'm opening a can of uh, diced tomatoes. And we're going to add that half a can to our soup. Gives it a nice rich color. And then of course our part. So now we have all the ingredients here. And that's how you make chicken soup. Now we're going to let that cook for at least an hour. And if you wish you can put potatoes in there right away. And then we're going to just serve it with some uh, small noodles, and we'll be back to finish it up. Okay, we're back here again, and uh, you can see that our chicken soup is cooking really nice. And uh, we've cooked it about an hour and a half on uh, medium to low heat, and uh, we're getting ready to serve. So, I remember, take out your bay leaf. And discard it. You don't want anybody eating that. Is I have some leftover pasta noodles, spaghetti noodles, angel hair, that I made yesterday. So you can heat these noodles a little bit in the microwave. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to spoon our broth. And I want you to take a real good look at this beautiful chicken soup. Big chunks of vegetables. 
and uh, we're going to take and we're going to spoon it right in to this spaghetti. Doesn't that look great? And the taste is perfect. Now, if you decide that you think it should need more salt or more pepper, you can go ahead and add some. But right now, with our recipe the way it is, uh, we have a perfectly seasoned soup. So here's what I'm going to tell you what we did. A recap on the recipe. We took our chicken breasts and we pan fried them in a tablespoon of olive oil. We added uh, a little bit, a sprinkle of our seasoned salt. Then we added our ch chunks of carrots, celery, and onions. And we put in two 14 ounce cans of uh, chicken broth with salt. We added two cups or two and a half cups of water. And I, I love to use my bottled water. If you can get spring water, that's what I like to use in all of my cooking. And then I added a bay leaf. And I put in a little bit of pepper and some parsley. So check out our recipe for our delicious soup on my blog at Lee's Italian Kitchen.